The NFL provides many different ways for fans to watch live games and parts of games, whether it be on Sunday or after the game is played. So we offer um, a, pa a out of market, uh, out of country package. So if you're living internationally, you can stream all the games online via a product we called Game Pass. You can also watch every game after they've been played. So starting at midnight on Sunday for a uh, the subscription product that we call Game Rewind. And then during the games, you can stream the Sunday night game on NBC. And then for the NFL Network game, we offer a companion product called NFL Live. And it's an online companion product where we look into the games, we analyze the games, and show highlights from other games. Every Sunday, you can see highlights from the games only on NFL.com, and you can see them after the game. And also this year, we're offering in-progress highlights. So Chris Johnson um, scores touchdown. You can see that right after it happens on NFL.com. So we have a number of ways to follow the game if you're not seeing the live game on NFL.com. And it, it really is what a lot of people do online and on their mobile phone, which is increasingly becoming more and more important. So you can follow what we call Game Center, where we have a 3D drive chart, shows you everything that's happening. We put in-progress highlights in there. You can follow all the statistics. You can rate the players. You can comment on the game. And one of the other ways we find to reach this younger demographic is through social media. They want to comment. They want to rate players. They want to talk about what's going on. So we make that available online and via mobile to reach that market. So it's been the NFL, this is our second year of streaming the NBC, the Sunday night NBC game. The response has been great. We have uh, many users and the user base is growing. And, and that product offers the main game feed, but it also shows a camera cam, a sideline cam, and other camera angles, which people go and check out during the broadcast to see other, um, other angles. There's also a social media aspect of that where fans can chat with one another, can chat with um, personalities, television personalities as well. And so it makes the whole experience interactive and we've been very pleased with the results. I, I think you'll see more and more game video online. And you know, one of the things that the NFL has is a scarcity of product. We don't play games every day of the week. We don't play games for six months of the year. So broadcast is much more accessible to, m to most homes. Um, and, but we are trying to find more and more ways to offer fans the, the games online. So mobile, as I'm sure everyone is aware, is becoming more and more important. And we have, a, we have a partnership with Sprint now where you can get the Thursday night games that we stream on the network live over the mobile phone. So tonight's San Francisco Bears game you can watch on your Sprint phone. And you can also get highlights as well as the NFL Network online. I think you'll see importance of the mobile phone growing. The other interesting thing that DirecTV did this year is if you have NFL Sunday ticket, you can access the games via an iPhone app. So you can watch the games if you can't be at home via your iPhone. Now we are on NFL.com just trying to find ways to engage our fans and give them more ways to consume the game, more ways to participate with the community and become bigger and bigger fans.